this is my second round and you can see the dirt oh my god look at this i have two pets and this is actually just from one i think because the other one does not shed as much as the the older one so far i like this product and i think it's doing a good job i just ran out of battery so i'm charging it right now and i yeah, I think the battery should have lasted a little bit more, but yeah. I'll wait for it to charge and then clean the rest of the part and then, yeah. I'm charging my vacuum cleaner right now and I just made this as a temporary charging spot, um, but I'm going to change it. So this comes the base and here's the charging. So you just take this out, off, like pull it up like that and you just... Uh, that easy and then just put it back and it charges as you see the sign here like just pull up put it back it's that simple it doesn't stuck get stuck or anything so it's very easy it's like normally there's a magnetic thing that stops you know it pulls the base but doesn't this is very simple it's very easy that way you don't have to drill this base anywhere that's why I like that part and I'm just gonna quickly show you what came with this package Again, this is the one, right? There you go. Okay, this is what it came with. So there's an extra roller and one more roller here. So it came with like three rollers, one already in the vacuum and two extra. And then also it came with two solution, one outside and one inside this little box. So this one has a solution and a filter. And also came with an additional two filters. You can see like two, there are two filters here. And um, actually this is one filter, sorry. Yeah, this is one. And I have another one here. And one's already installed. So that's three filter total. And there's a brush, a cleaning brush. And this is a holder for these. I think it's for this one. It doesn't really say on the manual, but I'm thinking it's for this one. So it came with a holder. And this also came with a holder for a filter, which is good. The only thing I haven't figured it out is where to place these holders. Like, I see a space. Oh, this is a little tricky here. There we go. There's a spot here, but I don't, just don't know like where to slide this in. It's just I'm just gonna leave it like that. I'm just not gonna bother um, trying to fix this, right? So this is all we came with. It's a good deal, I think. I bought it from Costco um, under 250. I think it was 240 something, but with tax and everything, I think it was like around 260 or something. So yeah, actually I went back and checked um, my statement and I actually paid exactly $270.62, okay? So and I, th I think it's a good deal. I mean, this is not the the recent, um, the series, the latest one, but I got this one because I felt like this was a little affordable. So yeah, and I've never tried a wet one, like a dryer, I, I mean, uh, a vacuum which dries which vacuums as well as, as, well as it uh, mops. So I just wanted to try this out and I'm very excited and I'm happy with what I purchased. I just got done with like two tanks of it and I just, um, I need to clean this up after I'm done um, vacuuming the entire house. I just did a little half of the kitchen and uh, some of my uh, foyer and just this one room. And that was about it. I'm gonna finish it up in a while after it gets charged. I can quickly talk about how I set it up. So it's very easy. So this thing, um, this thing comes off and it was um, disassembled and I had to assemble it. So this, you have to put it. And um, this, the small one is where you put the solution and just put like one cup of it and then fill it out with um, tap water. And there's a max sign somewhere here. And you just um, put the, the water up, to, up until that point. And this is the tank where all the dirty water gets filled out and uh, you have to set this up this sh this will be out so you have to put it back and this will be out and this will be out and that's about it nothing else everything else is already in there the base like i said is so easy just put the charger and then you just have to charge it it's so easy all right that was about it um again i think i really like this product and i do recommend anyone who's trying to buy a new vacuum with um, a mop so this was my first time um, 
trying this Tinco product and I think I really like this one. So yeah, the battery life was a little off for me. And I think I, for, for like just like a few minutes, I used the Max. There's a, there's a button here. So there's a power. As soon as you power it, it turns on and you don't have to do anything. But there's a Max Echo option as well. I think I clicked it like just for a few minutes. And then I think that caused the battery to die. But I'm not sure. And the good thing about this vacuum is I'm going to show you right now, okay? So like this, and I'm just going to show you a good demo. Okay. So you saw that? If you accidentally hit the, oh, not a wall, but some kind of sofa or something, then it just automatically turns off. Thinking, I think, um, it's some kind of... Yeah, like that. But it does recognize, that I've noticed, it, it does recognize the wall, if you see. Like, it doesn't do the same thing for the wall, because it does recognize it's a wall. That's amazing. So I'm going to, I think it's, it has some charge now, I'm going to finish it up. And um, wrap up this video now. See, it turns off automatically. So step on it, pull it up, and then you turn this on. And yeah, if you do like that, then you don't even have to um, press the button. It just turns off automatically. Alrighty, this was it for this um, video. And I'm going to come back with another review. And if you like this video, give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And do um, let me know if you want, would like to see another review video of anything you think you could think of. Um, yeah, I'm just doing reviews that I think is useful for people. So yeah, let me know if you have any questions on this product and I, I will try to be as clear as possible. All right then, see you until next video. Bye.